The 301 controller has a number of advanced settings. In the normal list of parameters we see when we press the page key, we have the set point in degree C, the set point ramp rate and the timer settings. Then we return to the home display. If we press and hold the page key, we see some new parameters now appear. The first of these is t.typ, timer type. And if we press the arrow keys, this is where we can adjust and select between five different timer functions. Please refer to the operating instructions for more details of those functions. The next parameter we see is t.bnd, timer band. This is a setting in degree C and it adjusts how close the furnace temperature has to be to the set point before the countdown timer starts to count. In this example, timer band is set at 3 degrees C, so the countdown timer will start counting once the actual temperature is within 3 degrees C of the set point. That value can be adjusted using the up and down arrow keys. The next parameter is OPHI, output high percentage setting. Here we have it set to 10%, which is a very low value. Very often furnaces will be set to a much higher setting. It could be 100%. When delivered directly from the factory, the power value will be set to the optimum for that product. Please refer to the product operation manual to see the correct power setting for your product. If you're using a furnace at a very low temperature, then the temperature controller will be compromised. One useful adjustment that, that can be made is to reduce the amount of power the furnace has to bring the furnace under better control at lower temperatures. The next parameter is to do with calibration, but we won't cover that in this video. Please refer to the operation manuals for details on setting calibration offsets. Pressing the page key again returns the display to t.typ. You can either wait 30 seconds or press and hold the page key to return to the normal home display.